Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to transfer your Solana coins from your Binance account into your Phantom wallet and how to do it securely and in less than two minutes. So first of all, if you haven't installed your Phantom wallet, I will prepare a short guide to show you how you can install your Phantom wallet so you could purchase NFTs on the Solana blockchain or do whatever you want on this Solana platform. So if you install your Phantom wallet, this guide is for you. So just go into the right corner of your screen, press the Phantom Wallet, and on the top side of the screen, you could see where it says Wallet One. This is your address. You can just copy it to Clipboard. As you see, it's copied. After you copied the address of your Phantom Wallet, all you need to do is now enter your Binance platform. So let's log in and go into our wallet. Let's go into overview and now let's go into fiat and spot and we will go into Solana and press withdraw. We have now reached the withdraw crypto page. As you can see in select coin, we are now at Sol. That's the token of the Solana blockchain. In order to choose my phantom wallet address, I will go to addresses that I already added to my Binance and I will select my wallet. I will press I understand. And if you didn't add the whitelist option on your Binance, you will have this option available, new address. You will just need to press on it, copy the phantom wallet that we have already copied before, press OK, and we will have the address pasted right here. As you can see, the network is sold. And in order to set the amount that we want to withdraw, we will just choose the amount here. In this case, I will just choose first of all the minimal amount. A small tip, it doesn't matter where you are going to withdraw from and where you are going to transfer your funds to. Always choose a minimal amount first, check that everything works fine and then transfer more. So in this case, I will transfer the minimal amount 0.2 SOL and I will just press withdraw and then I will press understand, confirm. I will check, double check that this is the wallet address of my wallet and I will press continue. And now it will ask me a verification code, an authenticator code. I will get them. Just one moment. And of course, I always uh, recommend to use a Google authenticator. I will enter the, I will enter the code and withdraw request submitted. And as you can see, I will transfer 0.2 SOL and I will have a small fee on the Solana network. Now, if you will scroll a bit down, you will see that recent withdrawal, it will be processing and you could see the wallet. And then uh, after it will finish the confirmation on the Binance platform, it will take a few minutes. You will be able to see it in your Phantom wallet. This could take a few minutes, 15, 20 minutes, only because the Binance platform has its own approval. If you will do it on the Solana network with two phantom wallets, it will take much faster. So a few minutes have passed and you can see that our recent withdrawals, this withdrawal is completed. And if we will go into our phantom wallet and go into recent activity, you can see that we received 0.19 SOL from our Binance account. And that's it. It was that simple to transfer funds from our Binance into our Solana platform. If you have any questions, if you have any question, if you have any questions, shush, if you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below and I will try to answer all of them. By the way, I left a list of useful links below my video, like signing into Binance and getting 20% of all fees of the network for life or signing even into BlockFi account and getting up to $250 if you fund your account at BlockFi. You can even get a BlockFi credit card that you get cashback return in Bitcoin. Uh, that's it. If you have any questions, like I said, put them down in the video below and have a good morning, afternoon and good night. Ciao.